This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at buffer solutions. Buffer solutions resist a change in pH when small amounts of acid or base are added. A buffer solution can be prepared by reacting a weak acid with a strong base. In this reaction, ethanoic acid, which is a weak acid, reacts with a strong base, which is sodium hydroxide, to form a salt, which is sodium ethanoate, and water. The initial amount in moles of each reactant are 1 mole for the ethanoic acid and 0.5 moles for the sodium hydroxide. The strong base is the limiting reactant, therefore after the reaction we are left with 0.5 moles of ethanoic acid and 0.5 moles of salt. The final solution has equal amounts of weak acid and the salt of the weak acid and strong base, which is a buffer solution. Next we look at another way of making a buffer solution. An acidic buffer can be made by mixing together a weak acid and the salt of the weak acid and a strong base. Sodium ethanoate is the salt of a weak acid and a strong base. It fully dissociates to form sodium ions and ethanoate ions. The weak acid is ethanoic acid. It partially dissociates to form ethanoate ions and hydronium ions. Because ethanoic acid is a weak acid, the equilibrium lies to the left. So the buffer solution has a relatively high concentration of ethanoate ions and a relatively high concentration of ethanoic acid. Next we look at the response of the buffer solution to added acid. When hydronium ions are added to the buffer solution, they react with the ethanoate ions to form ethanoic acid. Next, the response to added base. When hydroxide ions are added to the buffer solution, they react with the ethanoic acid to form ethanoate ions and water. Next, we look at a basic buffer solution. A basic buffer can be made by mixing together a weak base and the salt of the weak base and a strong acid. Here we have the weak base, which is ammonia, and it reacts with water to form the ammonium ion and the hydroxide ion. Because this is a weak base, the equilibrium lies to the left. Ammonium chloride is the salt produced from a weak base and a strong acid. This fully dissociates to form ammonium ions and chloride ions. So the buffer solution contains a high concentration of ammonia and a high concentration of ammonium ions. Next we look at the response of the buffer solution to added acid. When hydronium ions are added to the buffer solution, they react with the ammonia to form ammonium ions. Next, the response to added base. When hydroxide ions are added to the buffer solution, they react with the ammonium ions to form ammonia and water. 